Hi, my name's Beth and today I'm going to show you how to print sashes. So first of all, load your sash ribbon and your transfer foil into your printer. Obviously this video is relevant to all of the printer models so just watch the correct video for loading ribbon and foil for the model that you have. Once loaded, I can show you how to print. So, I've actually created a design already, so I will load the design that I've created and then explain how to print. So if you're printing a sash which you'd like to have print on the back and the front, you need to print the back first. If you're printing a sash where you only want the print on the front, that's fine, you just pull out the blank ribbon for the back first you will need to pull out one metre of blank ribbon for a blank back and then you print the design for the front which needs to be 60 centimetres long. So this is the design that I've created for the front of the sash. See it's 60 centimetres? Okay so I'm going to be printing a double sided sash today so I've actually got a back ready as well. So if I open up the back first and then I need to pull out some blank ribbon for the tail. So first of all, we need to pull out 20 centimetres of blank ribbon. That is for the tail, for the back of the sash. So you've got get a little ruler or a me measure. Just lie it out so that you can release the print head and measure out. It doesn't have to be exact, but approximately 20 centimetres Okay, and then click the print head back down. So this is the tail for the back. Now I'm going to print the design for the back. So I'll send the print now. Select the printer. And send the print. Now we need to pull out 20 centimetres of blank ribbon for the shoulder. So first of all, re release the print carriage and then again, use a tape measure. You'll probably be able to start guessing this because it doesn't have to be exact. And pull out 20 centimetres roughly of blank ribbon. Then click your print head back down. And now we're ready to print the design that will show on the front of the sash. So go back to Diamond Design. And again, I've already created a design, so I'll load the design that I've created. For the front. And then simply send the print. Don't forget you will need your tape measure again. So now that's finished printing, release your carriage again, lift up the print head and then using your tape measure that you got set ready, pull out approximately 20 centimetres of blank ribbon and then this is where you now need to cut. So we'll just get the scissors and then just cut it straight for now. Okay, so now we've printed and cut the sash off, you can see we have the front and the back. And just to finish off, just take the two ends together and then cut off on the diagonal. And you can provide some self-adhesive Velcro for your um, customer to close the ends of the sash. And there you go, that is how to print sashes. If you'd like any more help with anything at all, just give us a call or visit the website.